the FBI, is an American television series broadcast on ABC from 1965 to 74. It was sponsored by the Ford Motor Company, and the characters almost always drove Ford vehicles in the series. Alcoa and American Tobacco Company co-sponsored the first season only with Ford. Synopsis Produced by Quinn Martin and based in part on concepts from the 1959 Warner Brothers theatrical film The FBI Story, the series was an authentic telling of all fictionalized accounts of actual FBI cases, with fictitious main characters carrying the stories. Ephraim Zimblist, Jr., played Inspector Lewis Erskine, a widower whose wife died as a result of an ambush that was meant for him. Philip Abbott played Arthur Ward, assistant director to FBI, Chief J. Edgar Hoover. Although Hoover served as series consultant until his death in 1972, he was never seen in the series. Stephen Brooks played Inspector Erskine's assistant, Special Agent Jim Rhodes, for the first two seasons. Ling Loring played Inspector Erskine's daughter and Rhodes love interest, Barbara, in the first few episodes of the show. Although the couple was soon engaged on the show, that romantic angle was soon dropped. In 1967, Brooks was replaced by veteran actor William Reynolds, who played Special Agent Tom Colby until 1973. The series would enjoy its highest ratings during this time, peaking at no. 10 in the 1971-1971 season. For the final season, Shelley Novak played Special Agent Chris Daniels. Some episodes ended with her Most Wanted segment hosted by Zimbalist, noting the FBI's most wanted criminals of the day. The most famous instance during the series run came following the April 21, 1968 episode, when Zimbalist asked for information about fugitive James Earl Ray, who was being sought in the assassination of Dr. Martin Luther King, Jr. The series aired on ABC at 8 p.m. Sunday from 1965 to 1973, when it was moved up to 7.30 p.m. for the final season. The series was a co-production of Quinn Martin Productions and Warner Brothers Television, as Warner Brothers held the television and theatrical rights to any project based on the FBI story. It was the longest running of all of Quinn Martin's television series, having aired nine seasons, episodes. Today's FBI, an updated and revamped version of the series, Today's FBI, executive produced by David Gerber for Columbia Pictures Television, aired on ABC from October 1981 through April 1982 in the same Sunday 8 p.m. time slot as its predecessor, a remake of the original series, produced by Ron Howard's Imagine Entertainment for Fox, was set for air in fall 2008. However, that series has yet to air. A new FBI TV series is scheduled to debut in fall 2015 on ABC. DVD releases. Warner Brothers has released all nine seasons of the FBI on DVD in Region 1 via their Warner Archive collection. These are manufacturer-on-demand releases and are available through Warner's online store and Amazon.com. The ninth and final season was released on September 23, 2014.